Here's another quick tip. Quick tip. The posterized time effect locks a layer to a specific frame rate. You're probably thinking, but why do I need that when I can just change the frame rate in the composition settings? Or just pre-compose a layer and change the frame rate of the pre-comp? Well, pre-comps can be messy and can add extra computation to your scene, increasing render times. You can actually achieve some quite cool stylistic effects by having different frame rates within the same composition. You can even fake a stop motion look by choosing a really low frame rate. You can also apply it to film. For example, here I have applied the effect to 60 frames per second footage, locking it to 24 frames per second to give it a film-like look. It's quite a subtle effect, and YouTube compression probably makes it even subtler. Just search for the effect and drag it onto your layer, then set the frame rate in the options. Let me know in the comments if you use this effect, and in what situations you've used it in. Check out my Patreon to get access to exclusive project files and asset packs, discount codes or some great plugins, and at the same time support the channel. You can also join the Discord server where you can chat about animation, get feedback on your work from other community members, promote yourself and more. And as always guys, see you on the flippity flop.